Good morning, everybody. I actually made it to work fine today. The roads weren't bad. It was just kind of slippery outside, but um, yeah, I got here fine, so that's great. Today is a neat day, and I brought one of my new blueberry muffins, animal crackers, ruffles. I'm gonna make another veggie burger, and I also brought an apple and cookies. I brought a lot of food today, <laughs> but um, everything I'm eating is pretty low in calories, so that's good. Probably gonna be busy again today, it's dreary, it's cold, so I'm excited to have something to do at least. Probably leave at four like normal and go home and figure out something to do for the rest of the day. I'm home and now I'm waiting until a little bit later in this evening so I can make spaghetti because I'm excited for some spaghetti. I've not had spaghetti in a while and I've been craving pasta, so I'm excited. So, gotta wait for that time to come around. See how many calories it'll have in it. I'm gonna use this pasta sauce from Aldi, tomato, onion, and garlic, and of course the noodles and some hamburger, so I'm excited. <laughs> I did end up eating another cookie today and the animal crackers I brought with me for lunch and then cookie for snack, so this is why I don't make cookies because then I eat on them and I shouldn't be. I need to get rid of them really bad. Anyway, I'm gonna get off here and uh, do something for the next 30 minutes, hour, to uh, pass the time so I can make some dinner. I will talk to you guys in a little bit and show you what it looks like, even though it's just gonna be pasta, spaghetti, and meat. Well, it's the end of another day, and it was an emotional one um, at the end there, just feeling really down on myself again. This happens often it's something that i need to learn to get over but like i've told you guys before i'm gonna be very real with you on my channel i'm not gonna just make it all fun and games and happy and stuff all the time because that's not who i am and i don't want to be somebody who's fake on youtube i want to be real and show you guys how i really am um basically i was just having more negative thoughts on my body something i've always struggled with when you're told your whole life that you're basically not good enough in the eyes of society and stuff. It takes a toll on you emotionally. And um, yes, I am working to better myself and that's for me, that's not for anybody else. But I still get sucked into those idealistic views of the world and compare myself to people that I shouldn't and stuff like that. So I do struggle a lot with my body image still and things like that. Um, it's just something that I think I'll eventually get over, but I do still struggle with it a lot, um, especially during a certain time of month. So that's really what happened tonight. Kind of talked with Ian about it a little bit, and uh, he always makes me feel a little bit better, so that's good. For dinner, I ended up making spaghetti. I didn't show you guys what it looked like because it was just spaghetti <laughs> noodles, uh, of course, and sauce and... Um, some meat. I had about one and a half servings of that. I think it's about 500 calories per serving whenever I divvied it up. Um, so that's about what I had there. And then I also had another cookie. It's kind of what put me overboard. That means I had three cookies today and I should not have done that. That's why I try not to make sweets like that very often because I always have so many left over and um, they're just there throughout the week and I'm like, well, I want to eat these before they go bad and that's whenever I am kind of, you know, thrown into that whole, why did I do that? I'm never going to lose weight. I also measure myself and I haven't lost any more inches, which is also kind of devastating to me. Yeah, devastating. It's a big word. Um, it could just be like I've said before, because it's this time of the month, I could just be very bloated. I'm kind of hoping so. I also know that the month of February is a lot shorter. I'm kind of thinking I won't have much weight loss this month. Um, I'll be lucky to see five pounds, I think. So I know when I weigh myself and I see what I have lost, I'm probably going to be pretty upset then too. So I've kind of just eaten like shit the past week, it feels like, and I need to get back on track. I think I'm going to really start focusing on fruits and vegetables and that's going to be an actual goal for me. Instead of just saying it, I'm going to actually do it and kind of do research on things that I can find to eat healthier um, to kind of help with the whole fasting process. So that's where I am right now. I forgot to mention I also had a slice of bread with a little bit of butter for dinner. That was the 45 calorie bread and I think the butter was like 13 calories. Besides the point. I just wanted to throw that in there too, because 
I want to tell you guys what all I eat throughout the day as well. Anyway, that's my thoughts on this evening. Um, I'm ready for bed, so I'm going to do that. I did work out a little bit more, kind of, very lightly, because I'm so freaking sore. But I tried to work more on, like, my abs and core than just my um, glutes and legs and stuff like that. So we'll see how sore I am tomorrow. I'm going to go to bed, and I will talk to you guys in the morning. Say good night, Bowser. Good night. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. I did nothing to my hair today. It's a mess. So it's in a ponytail. The lazy girl's way of doing her hair. Today's a fasting day, so I won't be eating. I'm glad it's Friday. I don't know what I'm going to do tonight. I don't want to sit home. I'm over winter. It needs to be done now so I can do stuff because I'm alone a lot. So I don't really know what to do by myself when I'm alone, but if it was summertime, I could at least go out and do stuff. And it's just wet and cold and bleh here now so anyway I am going to go get some of the nasty work coffee and get to work for the day and I will talk to you guys later well I'm tired worked and then I went to Sprouts in Walmart and got some stuff I got home around 6 which was like 15 minutes ago so I already put away all my stuff from Sprouts I should have left that out so I could show you guys what I got but I did not so I'll show you what I got from Walmart um this cost me $95 and I'm not very happy about it. Um, everything I got at Sprouts was like 37 And it was a bunch of produce and stuff. So um, hopefully I can eat it all before it goes bad. But this is what I got at Walmart. Low carb tortillas. Medium and small eggs. Stuff. Things. You know. Bacon for something I might eventually make. Probably. Um, I don't know. I ended up getting some... Um, tofu at Sprouts. I've only had it like one time when my brother was making it. So hopefully I can figure out how to do something with that. I am waiting on Hannah to get here. I don't know what we're going to do tonight. Um, Ian and Wes are going to go play poker over at his friend's house. So we're going to hang out and kind of have a girl's night and kind of go from there. Don't really know what's going to happen. So we might go shopping. Um, she's moving and we'll need a couch soon. So we might go do that. But I don't really know right now what's going to happen. I'll let you guys know. I might even take you on an adventure with us because I think that'd be fun. I have a better time vlogging around her than I do with Ian, which is weird, but I don't know. <laughs> I'll see you guys in a bit. Well, it does not appear Hannah will be coming over tonight after all. Um, her and her boyfriend are working on getting a new apartment, and so they had to fill out the application online tonight, and it's taking a lot longer than they thought. So, looks like it'll just be me here tonight, and it's already 8.40, so I'm gonna like lay in bed and, you know, whatever. I normally do. All I really did tonight was have a cup of hot chocolate and then took a shower. So that is really it. Don't really have anything else to savor the day. Tomorrow's an eating day. I'm gonna go ahead and get ready for bed and I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Does anybody else notice that I start my Saturday vlog always sitting in this exact same spot on the couch? Because I just realized that. I need to change it up. <laughs> I am currently sitting down with a cup of coffee and one of my Greek yogurt muffins, so I'm going to eat that. And then I'm going to get up and I think I'm going to go to Target. Um, and I'm also going to go to Walmart or Charlotte Ruse. I just need to get out of here. <laughs> you know the feeling if you know the feeling. So I might come back and film some videos, but you know, I said that last weekend too and that never happened. So that's what I'm going to do. Don't know what's gonna happen today. Ian will come over sometime. We're gonna go out to one of our old teachers' um, comedy shows tonight. So we'll go do that. That's all I got planned for today. I don't know what we're gonna do for lunch yet. Um, we kind of wanted to go to Olive Garden and get the pizza bowls that they have out now. They look freaking amazing. Um, we might stay here. I got some avocados that I really wanna use before they go bad, so I might make some avocado fries. Uh, sounds interesting. I saw a recipe for it on Pinterest and I've been wanting to try it for a while, so we might do that. But I don't know. I'm gonna eat my muffin. I'm back from the store. I got a dress and a shirt and a couple of bras because I needed them because I've lost more inches. I've lost an inch around my bust, around my waist, and two on my hip. So that's good because the other day when I measured myself, I think it had to do. Um, with it being later on in the day and something else and uh, I measured myself today and saw a little bit different in the result so that's good um, but anyways I did get two bras, shirt, a dress, 
and I also ended up going over to pink and got a jacket and a bag that came with it um like it was 40 bucks it's the cheapest I've ever seen a jacket over there that's not on sale I guess so yeah I'm gonna wear that today and then I also got some different lotion because the lotion I got to use for the dry rubbing I've been doing is super sticky and like I woke up last night and I was like still sticky from like the lotion and that just is a gross feeling I don't like it um so someone else might like it I'm gonna give it to my mom she might like it <laughs> Ian is on his way we're gonna go to Olive Garden and get the new pizza bowls and I'm super excited because it sounds freaking amazing <laughs> we saw it on Facebook the other day and automatically had to have them so he is gonna be coming over for the day and then this evening we're going out so that's kind of where we are right now the pizza bowl is 860 calories I don't expect to eat all of it though so I'll kind of see how many I have left over afterwards I did walk around a lot at the mall so um, I think that will definitely even out some of the calories that I had from this morning from my muffin and the coffee and um, so I'm not really too worried about my calories yet today I don't know we're gonna be eating tonight or drinking or anything but we shall see Bowser's glad I'm home aren't you Bowser you glad I'm home he's the cutest freaking dog in the world just saying. So I haven't vlogged today. Day 174 fasting. It was a fasting day. Um, so I kind of figured I would roll yesterday's events and today's events all into one, of course. Um, yesterday, uh, Ian and I went and got the pizza bowl and then we came home and um, kind of just relaxed until it was time to go um i got ready and we went to my former teacher's comedy show which was super crowded so we only stayed for her act and then we left and went to ernie big's piano bar i may have gotten slightly intoxicated so yeah i didn't eat anything really yesterday besides the pizza bowl i did have a couple of um brownies that one of my coworkers had made and i brought home with me i had like half of them and then last night I also had some chips and queso from uh, Qdoba, which was across the street from the piano bar. Ian ran over and got some food since we hadn't eaten anything since lunch. And um, I guess I also did take one of the large avocados and mash it up um, yesterday for uh, like a snack, I guess, before Ian got over and I had some veggie chips too. Um, before we had the pizza bowl so i didn't mention that but that's also what i ate yesterday and i think that's really it we did drink a lot i ended up having two long islands and a fishbowl type of drink along with a shot last night um which is more than what i'm used to drinking i'm not a huge drinker um when i drink it's on rare occasions so yeah i drank last night didn't count those calories but i did stay under my food calories so i mean that's something right <laughs> and then today we woke up and i had a terrible headache I mean, yeah, that's that's gonna happen. So it was fasting day, and I didn't eat. And I had coffee and water, and that was, you know, normal. It was fine. I did end up eating a carrot throughout the day, and I tried some of the blueberries and a couple blackberries and a couple strawberries that I bought from Sprouts because I wanted to see if they were good enough to pack for my lunch tomorrow. If they were bitter, I didn't want to bring them, you know. I'm gonna be bringing those as a snack tomorrow, um, and uh, then I brought leftover spaghetti and muffin and a banana. But I'll talk more about that tomorrow, of course, too, what I'm going to be eating. However, that's really all I did today. Um, I did have a cup of hot chocolate as well to kind of help me get through the day. It's about 8 o'clock now, so I should be able to get through the rest of the day fine without eating. I just filled up my water bottle, so I'll be relying on that, too. But, yeah, that is what we did today. We ended up napping, too. And that's really the most exciting thing that happened, <laughs> which is fine. We were really tired and I've had a headache all day long. Figures, right? That is the end of this vlog. I will be starting week 26, I believe. Week 26 of fasting. It's kind of crazy to think. <laughs> Thank you so much guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Like I always say, of course. Thanks for sticking with me through my ups and downs. I know I struggle a lot with body image and things like that, but this is just real. This is me. And I'm not going to hide that and pretend like everything's fine and dandy all the time because, like I said before, I'm not going to be a fake YouTuber. It doesn't make sense. So, 
thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it and if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel like my videos it helps me out it helps me get noticed by other people who are trying to intermittent fast so i would like people to see my point of view on the whole process especially since i'm trying to lose a significant amount of weight with this process and um i want to show people that you can do it i will see you guys on my next video